thought there. A Buffalo man says he nearly died when he went to the hospital because he needed to wait two days for a negative COVID-19 test before getting surgery for appendicitis. Two on your sides, Karis Belger has his story. Now, good evening. I spoke with Casey Kratt. He's a photographer right here in Buffalo. He told me that recently he went to the hospital to get a procedure done when he was diagnosed with appendicitis. But before he could get surgery, he said that he had to wait two days to get the results of a COVID-19 test. Casey told me he was admitted to Miller Fillmore Suburban Hospital in early May. But before he could get a procedure done, he said he had to wait for the results of his COVID-19 test to come back negative. And in that time, he says his condition only got worse. Casey told me by the time his negative results came in and he was able to get surgery, he later required additional abdominal surgery. I argued with uh, every doctor and uh, every surgeon to stop by and said, you know, this is an appendicitis. It has to, even if I have COVID, it has to come out. If I was a COVID positive patient, I would, the OR would become very contaminated. Casey told me that hospital staff explained that if he had tested positive for COVID-19, there would be a separate set of procedures in place for when he got his surgery. He tells me he's finally home after having spent 11 days in the hospital and he's recovering with his family. But he hopes other people who hear his story will continue to be vigilant about their health if something is wrong, whether or not it's related to COVID-19. And I did hear back from a representative for Kaleida Health. He explained that Miller Fillmore Hospital and other Kaleida Health facilities are following the state's directions when it comes to testing patients for COVID-19. And that does include testing people who come in for emergency surgeries. In Buffalo, I'm Karis Belger, Channel 2 News.